Uh, hi, uh, today we will be learning about uh, the four wheel drive mechanism on an automobile uh, with the help of a layout. So, uh, this is an animation which shows uh, the layout of the transmission system of a uh, four wheel drive automobile. Uh, here you can see uh, this is the front axle and uh, this is the rear axle. Uh, this is the front right hand side wheel and this is the front left hand side wheel and this is the uh, rear uh, right hand side wheel and this is the rear left hand side wheel and this is actually the frame or the uh, chases so let's see uh, the basic components uh, uh, which helps drive an automobile uh, which are mounted on the chases so first we have uh, the engine or it is also uh, called as the prime mover so the prime mover is actually supplying the required uh, power for all the mechanisms in an automobile to function or uh, the prime mover or the engine is providing the drive uh, for all the mechanism in an automobile and next to the engine we have the flywheel uh, this is a rotating uh, disc uh, this is connected towards the engine crankshaft and as the engine powers uh, the flywheel rotates in the same rpm uh, of that of the crankshaft so this is the power takeoff point or uh, from the flywheel actually we are taking the power uh, for the functioning of other mechanisms and towards the flywheel a clutch is connected because uh, this is a manual uh, transmission mechanism uh, explained so a clutch is connected towards the flywheel so this engages uh, uh, the flywheel with um, the gearbox so uh, the uh, red mark is the engine here the uh, orange colored is the flywheel the green is the clutch so uh, as the clutch engages towards the flywheel uh, the drive from the engine reaches the flywheel is transmitted towards the gearbox so the yellow colored is the gearbox and the gearbox is connected towards a transfer box so uh, here which is blue colored marked is the transfer box so transfer box is the mechanism which is uh, transferring the power from the engine uh, which is uh, routed through the gearbox uh, towards the propeller shaft and both the rear axles so in a four wheel drive mechanism all the four wheels are getting drive as you know that in a two wheel drive mechanism either the front axle is getting the drive or the rear axle is getting the drive but in a four wheel drive uh, mechanism both the front axle and the rear axle is getting its drive so through this transfer box uh, this is a propeller shaft as you can see this long uh, black colored shaft is a propeller shaft and uh, uh, it has four uh, universal joints this uh, light blue colored uh, four universal joints are actually linked towards it because this propeller shaft is not straight it has some angular uh, twist and also it uh, requires to take vibrations when an automobile is uh, riding so to accommodate that vibrations and uh, these universal joints are connected in between so uh, in the front axle we have a differential this is the front axle differential and in the rear axle also we have a differential so the drive uh, coming from the engine which is routed through the uh, transfer port reaches the front axle differential and also the rear axle differential that means both the front axle and the rear axle is getting the drive that means the front right hand side wheel the front left hand side wheel and also the rear uh, right hand side wheel and the rear left hand side wheel is getting the drive that means all the four wheels are getting the drive so this is called a four wheel drive mechanism so i believe uh, you got an idea about the four wheel drive mechanisms and the systems uh, involved in it and you are clear about the layout also uh, for more engineering or automobile related videos you can visit my uh, blog that is www techtricksinfo.com or for uh, technical videos you can visit my youtube channel that is www.youtube.com oblique techtricksinfo you can also click the subscribe button uh, above the video to get daily updates as i upload more training videos thanks for watching this video